Apparently for that, Kraden. We now fight the Doom Dragon. I'm gonna let this uh, music kind of play out a little bit. It's one of my favorites in this game, so I'll, I'll silence myself and you guys can listen to it. It's really cool. <laughs> so, it, Doom Dragon, well, has a very... Um, <laughs> thankfully not as bad as Dulahan, but he has the, the same move as Dulahan where he can drain all of one person's gen. Uh, his can't move is just like he chooses to not do anything. And this guy has three stages that he can attack. Um, none of it's that great to deal with. <laughs> I'll just put it that way. Um, hmm. Not too bad right now, so I think a Ghost Soldier might be good. Uh, let's throw in another Angel's Spear. Actually, you know what? Just normally attack. Uh... Do Ghost Soldier, we're gonna do another Angel Spear. Well, we're going to do an Angel Spear and we'll do a Diamond Bird. Not too bad on the damage there. Wanna make sure we keep our attack up. 858. It would have been a lot more if the uh, <laughs> Jin weren't completely gone on Felix, but you know, we'll be back. Fiery Blast, uh, Earth Force, okay, that, okay, good, um, that can stun it in it, it stun one of you, it, it can stun you for a turn, so you want to be careful about that, um, just normally attack, we're gonna have her use Mana Core, uh, tch -tch -tch. Yeah, just normally attack, and normally attack. I want to see if I can pull off some unleashes, that would be great. Like that. 939, that's good. Oh, that's not good. Anchorin's Grief. 270, uh, not great. Blast Breath, ouch. Because he drops your defense by doing that. He can use Cure. Thankfully he doesn't heal a whole lot with it, but he does heal himself a tad. Uh, just normally attack again. We're going to have her use Estriblood. Um, Protector. And we're going to dispel that Grim Reaper there. It's a purple Ent. <laughs> But there you go. Uh, unfortunately, not a whole lot of damage, but we'll get we'll get through this. Flare storm and earthquake. Um. Yeah, just keep normally attacking. Uh, have a ghost soldier. Quick Strike would be good, and Diamond Bird would be good too. All right, nice. That's the first head gone. Now we're in the phase two. I. Oh, well, how about we actually show Grand Gaia from our side, not from a rando attacking us with it. Uh, quick strike, and we'll do a diamond bird. Oh yeah, that's never all that fun. Uh, so th that's basically the same thing as the uh, 
guard orb from the Star Magician fight. That's that thing's ability. Blast Breath. Uh, not good. Cruel Ruin is actually definitely not good. It's one of his specialties to do tons of damage with, because why not? Ouch, this is gonna hurt. Ooh, ouch, ouch. 622 damage on Felix. Ow. <laughs> Alright, we're definitely using Mana Core. Um, throwing up a magic shield. Raise resistance a little bit. Earth Force has no effect on Jenna. That's good because we need her to heal. Inferno! I did cast Resist, so we're good, kind of. Um, he's still kind of in the negatives there as far as his gen. We'll hopefully get better on that end. Have Felix cast Resist, and Isaac cast Protector. get our health back up, because good grief. I'd rather not have to deal with that Chaos Ruin, or Cruel Ruin, actually, it's not Chaos Ruin. Serpent Fume? Eh. This is not good. It, he's using Cruel Ruin quite a bit. That's not good. <laughs> That's really not good. Ouch! Okay, Isaac didn't take as nearly as much damage. Good. Ooh. Okay, the attack went to normal. Uh, we can do Thunderhead. I just actually just want to normally attack. Angel Spear. Dynamurg. Nice, Legend. Didn't do all three, so. That's not cool. We didn't get her a really good level up there. Curse? No. That's like... Yeah, that's just me. <laughs> that's just me, dude. Clay Spire. Yeah. Oof. This is gonna get rough. Okay, one more, and it's back to full. I'm gonna do Mana Core again. Jeez. Um. Okay, just top everything off and be good, not have to worry about that anymore. Maybe. Earth Force. Not too bad on the damage there. Oh gosh, no. <laughs> okay, he really likes using that move. <laughs> I knew he liked using that move, but sometimes it's just like, alright, that, that's a bit much. <laughs> Jitta has her work definitely cut out for her on this. Ouch! Dang, that, that damage on Pierce is not good. Um, I'm gonna use a Miss Potion. She's just she just needs it at this point. Uh, quick Strike, and we're also going to do a Restore on him. Ah, uh, all right. Inferno, it's gonna hurt Pierce. Oh, it didn't hit Pierce, good. Um Ooh, 
high impact. I don't know if they're gonna get really any more. They might get more. I forgot to redistribute that. My bad. Alright. Haunt. Oh, don't. Oh, okay. <laughs> We're good. Two ninety-eight. Yeah, Diamond Bird does way more damage. Um, oh, we got the second head. Alright, this phase is actually pretty nasty. <laughs> this is the final phase of the fight, so you can kind of expect that, but it's still not going to go down without trying to rip your throat out because it's <laughs> the final boss. I, that that Earth Force is really nasty if you, he attacks a slower person. So having high, uh, having people with high speed is a good idea. Um, hence why I have people that have high speed. Um, the only person that doesn't fit that bill is Piers, but that's fine. Um, Protector. We'll do a Diamondberg as well. Oh, great. He does a guard aura again. Uh, not the worst, but... Could have gone a lot better than that. Alright, um... Some magic shield. Alright, how much damage? Nice! 1573! That's a giant chunk of its health. Oh! That. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> Just getting low on health. Um, let's bring Garrett in. Um, we'll show off Liquifier. <laughs> we haven't done that yet. Oh, and we felled it. My bad. <laughs> I think I was a bit overpowered for this fight. I think I overprepared, but <laughs> there you go. But, yeah. Who are they? That's what I was trying to warn you about. It wasn't just the dragon you killed. I remember you warning us, but it was too late for us to stop. Creighton, what do you know? Why are you trying to stop us from fighting the dragon? Well, why were you? It was the Wise One's final trap. Trap? What do you mean? The Wise One knew he couldn't stop you, so he played a cruel, wretched trick on you instead. Creighton, I don't understand. What are you trying to tell us? Sheba, let's see who those people are while they sort this out. No, Jenna. Don't look. You mustn't look. It'll only bring you pain. What are you talking about, Creighton? They can't hurt us anymore. We'll just... What's the matter, Jenna? It can't be. How? How? <clears throat> what is it, Isaac? <clears throat> Isaac, I 
I know that guy. That's your dad. Then does that mean the other two are... Uh-oh. Uh... Mom, Dad! I'll heal Jenna's parents. Quickly, Mia, tend to Isaac's father. If only I realized it sooner. What's the matter, Pierce? Why'd you stop? Jenna's parents need you. Don't give up, Mia. You can't. You have to save them. It's no use, Ivan. I'm tapped. I am too. And even if I work, it's just too late. What are you saying? They're, they're not. They can't be. That's not what I'm saying, Jenna. I... I finally found them. I was going to be with them again for the first time in years. Jenna. Please. It can't be. Mom, wake up. It's me. It's Jenna. Don't leave me. Jenna, you must prepare yourself for what comes next. Being transformed into a drag, fight it in that form. It requires tremendous power. What are you saying, Crane? In fighting you, your parents were forced to use every last ounce of their energy. They don't have the strength to... Even if they had won the battle, they would not have survived. You cannot blame yourself. You monster! Why did you do this? Why did you make us fight Jenna's parents? You're no god. You're no protector. You're evil. You just don't understand the pain you've caused, wise one. You have no idea the damage done to a child who learns she's destroyed her own parents. That's enough. I knew what I was doing the moment I raised my sword. We defied the wise one in order to save the world. Our parents would understand. Don't you think so, Felix? I think they would. You're right. It hurts. But it's true. We didn't do this for ourselves. We did this for all of Wayard. We still have a chance to save Prox. Perhaps we can't save your parents, but we can save countless others. Kyle and the others saved them too. They sacrificed their own lives so that we could go on. I never imagined that my actions would help save the world. Even lighting the beacon can create wars and strife. I regret none of this. There's little time left. Felix, use the Mars Star to light the beacon. Well, and light the beacon. You know, do things. But before we do that... <sighs> Felix, I can't see you. But I can sense that you're nearby. Please, take care of Jenna for us. Felix, shut up. I'm so happy to have one last chance to see you again in the end. <coughs> Felix, you made it back alive. Please, I must ask one last thing. To help Dora to live her life. Fool us for me. I can't use mind read or anything. I wish I could console you somehow. It must be tough. I wish I had one last chance to have some of Felix's mother's cookies. <laughs> of course. I don't know my parents. You might be alive somewhere out there, but I share your pain. Both Kyle and your parents were very dear to me. My sorrow joins yours, friends. You must light the beacon for... If... For no other reason than to provide them with a proper funeral. No, not yet. Felix, I understand your loss. But, I re but remember, you and Jenna still have each other. 
If Alex sets this, set this all in motion, then he's responsible for this. And I'll never forgive him. Our quest is almost over. I don't know how I'm going to tell Mom about all this, but sorrow can wait. We've got to light the beacon. Nope. We're not doing it yet. <laughs> We've got other people to talk to. I thought I'd get to see my parents again. I thought I'd get to hold them again. But instead, I'm forced to destroy them. I'm sorry things had to end up like this, Jim. Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. Beacon is lit. And to think, I joined this quest hoping to prevent it exactly this from happening. And I began this quest as a prisoner, taken against my will. And if that tidal wave hadn't sent me far off course, I wouldn't be I wouldn't even be here now. How many lives have been taken and changed forever just to light this beacon? Mom Dad, where it is safe now. You're right. I hear her voices too. I told you. I told you I could hear them. Who said that? Where are you? We're in a mill. We're at the base of Mercury Lighthouse. You, you can't be. You, you can't be. I know that voice. It's Mia. I just know it. Mia! It's you. Of course it's us. We can hear you, Mia. You're all right. I'm so happy. Who are those two kids talking to? I don't know. They've been standing here telling everyone to leave the lighthouse. We had a couple of kids, if you ask me. How is it that we can hear you? I don't know, but he told us that we'd be able to talk to you if we came here now. He? Who's he? I don't know. We were sleeping. Then he came to us in a dream. He said, go to the lighthouse. The lighthouse? Why? He said that we have to deliver a message. He was too busy to do it himself. What message? We have to warn everyone to stay clear of the lighthouses. What's going to happen? I don't know, but he told us to warn people to stay away from Mount Alf as well. But who is he? You still haven't told us. You're a meanie. I don't tell meanies anything. Don't pay him. Uh, don't pay any attention to him. It's me, Mia. Can you tell me who spoke to you? I told you. I don't know. He looked like a big rock. A big rock. A bit. A big rocky eye. The wise one. What could he be doing? Of course, I understand. The wise one said that when all four lighthouses have been lit, the golden sun will shine. When that happens, Mount Alf and the lighthouses will probably become quite dangerous. So the wise one's warning people in dreams, tell them, telling them to seek refuge. Why would he do that? You saw what he did to us. He can't be up to anything good. Have you not learned? One's actions do not always reveal one's true intentions. Hama! Sister! Master Hama, did you receive a message too? Yes, I was called to Jupiter Lighthouse in a dream. You have completed your quest, but it seems to come with a great loss. Your suffering has been almost unbearable. Master Hama, my parents. I know, Jenna. And I am sorry, but do not give up hope for them just yet. What do you mean, Master Hammer? Appearances can be an illusion. I an illusion. The wise one has a caring heart. He forced us to fight Isaac and Jenna's parents. 
What's so caring about that? If the wise one were truly evil, he would not be warning me of the danger in my dreams. Well, I... I guess not. But then what's he up to? We do not have time to discuss it right now. She's right. If the wise one said it's not safe to be near the lighthouses, then I think we should listen. I'm heading for safety too. All of you must get away from the lighthouse now. Hurry everyone, let's go. What about our parents? We can't leave them behind. I understand how you feel, but we won't make it if we have to take them with us. Make a decision, Felix. Should we take them with us? I mean, if anything, we want yeah, I think we should. It's too dangerous. The golden sun is forming. A ray of light is emanating from the beacon, from the Mars star. What will happen? The power of alchemy will be unleashed upon the world. We must take Isaac and fa uh, Isaac's father and Jenna's parents and flee. What happened to Felix? Come on. <laughs> Stop it! Let go of my wrist! Gary, get a grip! No one's touching you! I'm serious! I... The beacon! Jenna, we have to move your parents. Mom! Dad! What's happening? There's no time for questions. Just carry them. Carry them and go! 